We had the Encyclopedia Britannica at home. And uh, even when I was a small boy, he used to sit me on his lap and read to me from the Encyclopedia Britannica. And we would read, say, about dinosaurs. And maybe it would be talking about the Brontosaurus or something. And he would, he would say something like, or the Tyrannosaurus Rex. You know, and it would say something like, uh, this thing is 25 feet high, and the head is six feet across, you see, and so on. And he'd, so he'd stop always and say, let's see what that means. That would mean that if he st stood in our front yard, he would be high enough to put his head through the window. But not quite, because the head is all a little bit too wide and would break the window as it came by. Everything we'd read would be translated as best we could into some reality, so that I learned to do that. That everything I read, I tried to figure out what it really means, what it's really saying uh, by translating it. And uh, so I used to get read the encyclopedia when I was a boy, but with translation, you see. So it was very exciting and interesting to think that there was animals of such magnitude. I wasn't frightened that there would be one coming in my window as a consequence of this, I don't think. But I thought it was very, very interesting and that they all died out. And at that time, nobody knew why.